We believe sincerely that the root of everything is women's liberation. It's important for us to recognise that women who want something more than they already have have always been called angry and greedy and man-hating, but I don't think that the basis of what feminism is has changed. It's about being treated fairly and having equal access, equal opportunity and safety. We think that the way that men used to speak to women now has changed, but of course now the US has a president who speaks about women and to women um, in that way all the time. I mean, it surprises me and I really hope it surprises women and men everywhere that the US elected a president who was happy to admit he was a pussy grabber. Even today uh, in Australia we discover statistics which tell us that about half of women have experienced harassment over the course of their lives. What's changed over time is that we have more transparency about the data. Women have louder voices now because they have better access to education, they have better access to jobs, but they still don't have the same access. So what's relevant for the Town Hall affair to today's audience is that women are still struggling in exactly the same way. We don't have um, individual characters so much like um, Germaine Greer speaking out for everybody. I hope people who watch it recognise how little has changed for women and for men and I think that once we can persuade everyone that we are starting from a position of not much progress, everyone will get together to recognise that if we make progress for women we're also making progress for men. After we'd done the town hall uh, debate, a mailer who was the absolute archetypal um, chauvinist, he said, I didn't really understand what women's liberation was about. And then he did. And if we can change his mind, I think we can change everyone's mind.